Being an American at the U.S. Open is great, but Charleston takes the cake. Beep, beep. Okay, right now I would like you to take me to my bed. I'm a little bit tired, but anywhere, I really want to go to Greece. It's on my bucket list. I've never been. So Maria Sakari, like, help me out, girl. I mean, that's impossible. How are you going to ask me something like that? I, if I had to answer right now, I'd say Lion King. I mean, that's a feel-good movie. You got the tears, the happy Timon and Pumbaa. That's quality. A couple at the French Open, you know, when I made the quarterfinals that year, they were incredible. But then my matches here this week have been amazing. I didn't realize I could feel this many emotions at one time. So those are definitely at the top of the list. Nicolescu is really tough, right? Just because she's so unorthodox and sweetest girl ever. I love being around her. And I actually haven't seen her yet, but. She just makes it very difficult. She's very seasoned and knows exactly where to put the ball and move it around. Oh my gosh. Brownies are my weakness. Brownies are great. Um, popcorn's amazing. Um, I'm trying to think of something exciting. Brownies, popcorn, maybe like a key lime pie. Oh my God, that sounds good. Come on, Charleston, I love playing here. It's so much fun. Um, aside from Charleston, I would have to say uh, New York's really fun too. Yeah, being an American at the US Open is great, but Charleston takes the cake.